Ooh, happy Friday, everyone. It's going to be a great day. I'm going to finish today off strong, finish this week off strong. I'm um, working from home, which means a little programming, but I also get to do some work around the house while taking breaks from programming, which is just fine. <sighs> but right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy myself one GameStop uh, stock. Last time I checked, it was three fifty-seven a share. A little spendy, quite a bit spendy, but I'm not buying it as an investment. I'm buying it because I just want to be part of the game. I know I'm going to lose this money. But, you know, how many times do you go to a casino and spend two hours, you know, just gambling and knowing that you're going to lose the money? It's just accepted. The price of entertainment. Go to a football game. You're going to drop $500 for two tickets. So, I'm going to buy a game stock, stock, expecting to lose it all. But I get to screw the man, right? This is literally a slot machine. Where is it going to stop? Where is it going to stop? Down at the skate park, getting ready to start my morning run. One of the reasons I come down to the skate park to run rather than just walking outside my door and start running is my dog. She follows me if I start running down the hill, so I got to get away from the house. And it's not that I don't mind taking my dog on a run. I used to take her all the time but she reacts to anything she sees on the run, like a cat or a bunny or something to that effect. And when I got her on a leash, she jerks me. So uh, my back starts to hurt after every run with her, and I couldn't take that anymore. I would like to run with her, but uh, I just can't do it. So anyway, I'm gonna put you guys back into the car because I don't wanna run with the camera today. And uh, I'll let you know how it went. All right, 6.9 miles, pretty good. A uh, little uh, tired, but it was easy. It's funny, my dad kind of called me when I was um, running and I ran probably two miles just talking to him, which was fun. It was kind of two birds with one stone, took my mind off of working out. A little short breath, a little slower pace, but it was fun. And even though I said I wasn't going to take the video camera, I did bring my phone. So, uh, I wanted to show you this. What the hell is that? Someone tied a mask to a stick? Like a hobo? 19 Depression Era hobo, but with a mask? Well, it's 9 o'clock. I got to go log on for work and I got to get after it. So let me get going. Well, work has been uh, a little bit more busy than normal today. I was hoping to get some more things done around the house. It's not happening. But I'm going to take about 15 minutes away from the uh, keyboard and uh, go ahead and fill that wood thing up. Well, I'm not going to fill it up. I'm just going to get one trailer load. So let's go ahead and do that. Three days of wood in there. Then put the rest up in the woodshed. Well, work was a little bit uh, more than I expected today, so I didn't get anything done around the house. And then I had a choice after I got off work: do I go ahead and do things, or do I go ahead and take a nap? Well, with it being Friday night, I'm going to take a nap so I don't fall asleep at ten tonight. 
So uh, what we're going to do as a family is we're going to make ourselves some pizza. I guess we only get one, so. Well, there's no more if you want the second one. Okay, we'll see. Maybe I'll have the second one. So, um, this was funny. My daughter, who's upstairs in the loft, um, that's a long story in itself, but uh, all the time it's like, Mia, can you feed the dogs? Mia, can you do this? Mia, can you do that? And whenever we say Mia, she uh, never responds. She's always sleeping. But I come in here today and I'm like, babe, talking to my wife, you'll never guess what happened. You know, kind of like I've got gossip. My daughter jumps up and starts running down the stairs. What? What's going on? What's going on? Selective hearing, isn't that? Okay, I'm going to go real simple on my pizza. First, we're going to get some ragu sauce on it, just like my grandmother used to make. Grandmother never made pizza sauce, but it sounds good for the, for the show. Let me show you what we have here. Go make the kids eat. Some pizza sauce. Cheese. Cheese. Crap, just like my grandmother used to make. Back in the old country. The Bronx. That was the old country. Yeah, a lot of cheese. Now I'm going to show you what the key is. is you come back with the sauce and you dip it on it. I used to work at a pizzeria. I know about this stuff. Boom. 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 Look at that. You see, this is the key. And it's going to spread out like a prostitute when the ships come in. Now, I'm going to put some veggies. We got peppers, we got onions, and we got different peppers. Yeah, look at this. Be good if I had two cameras going so I could show you at the same time, but. Are you going to put pepperoni? No, I'm going to put pepperoni. What? You know how many freaking pigs died because of that? Oh, whatever. I'm a humane person, mm -hmm. huh? Get with the, get with the, get with the game. All right. All right, we're just going to throw that in the oven and we're going to let that cook. Maybe I'll throw a little bit more cheese on oh, You know what? I'm going to throw some Parmesan cheese on there. Ooh, just like my grandmother used to make back in the old country. Yeah. It's good. That's good. My grandmother used to bake her uh, pizzas in the oven. Just like they did in the old country. Oh, if you've seen my videos before, you know uh, cheap white Pino Grigio is my um, go-to wine. But when I start off drinking, I like buy one bottle of uh, good wine. When I say good wine, better than the cheap wine. It's kind of second shelf rather than the fourth shelf. I mean, I think this was probably like 10 bucks a bottle. That's not, it's still cheap, but still, it's not as cheap as the box wine. So you start off with this, and then after that, after your first drink anyway, it doesn't make a difference what you drink. It all tastes the same. taking our first intermission right now and Mia is just crushing us. She's the only one with a monopoly and she's got two houses on each one. She's got boardwalk. Um, she just landed on free parking. All the money I put at the free parking because I keep on getting screwed. She took and she goes and builds houses and then charges me, on, me rent on it. Eat the rich. It's ridiculous. But um, I'm coming back. I've got a plan. Hold on. Advance to the next railroad. If 
unowned, I can buy it if owned. That's me. That's twenty-five dollars. Twenty-five dollars. Yeah, I'm not giving you a break this time. So here's the deal. Let me throw this out to the audience so you could be the judge. Can I get five dollars? Before back? let me tell my story. Before I had hold on Mia, before I had mo hotels on my meridian over here, it was a two dollar rental. My wife, she goes ahead and she lands on it, right? She lands on it. It's a two dollar rental, right? I give her 50% discount. So no, she only has to pay a dollar. No. Pay only. So I land on her railroad where it's fifty dollars and she wants to give me a dollar discount instead of the fifty percent that I gave her. Fifty percent! No, that's not free. I went on something that was like twenty-two dollars and you just charged me. No, $20. no, no, no. I gave you a fifty percent discount on a two dollar rent and you Yeah. So we're calling it a night. Mia is crushing everybody, although I'm doing okay, and my and my wife just hit flannel free parking. But here's the kicker of it. So we're gonna call this a night, and this video is done. My wife just says, "Can we take a break for the night? My back is really hurting." As if, hey, you know, we've been just running for like 12 miles. Can we take a break? You know, my legs kind of tightening up. Now we're playing Monopoly. Can we take a break? My back is killing me. Oh, I should mention that I cleaned the whole house and I've kept the kitchen clean. I did all the laundry and I did the shopping and I organized all the closets. But my back is hurting I, 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 because of this hour long Monopoly game. <laughs> Go ahead, edit you, that part out. Yeah, you do know that I've got the power of editing. Uh, I do. I'm like God here in front of the 20 people that watch this show. I think you've got like 30 followers. Yeah. Yeah, but it's depending on the account. Yeah, I got 30 followers. I got 35 on uh, YouTube. But I got like 200 on, on Facebook. But well, Facebook doesn't pay you. I need them on YouTube. Go to my YouTube channel. Anyway, have a good night, guys. We'll see you in a... I'll see you in a couple days. No, I've been doing it every twice a week I do. Okay. All right. I'm going to have another one this weekend. Bye-bye.